Facebook at Y254, we're on Twitter at Y254 channel, and on Instagram at Y254 underscore channel, on TikTok at Y254 channel. My personal is at It's Barry Moore. It's Social Friday on Y in the morning. We're doing everything social, and now it's time to socialize or interact with our guest of the day. She's a gospel artist. She goes by the name Grace Osea Karibusan. Thank you, Barry. All right. Yeah. Uh, I've been looking forward to this. Uh, uh, I read your bio and then we had a conversation in the morning with VDJ Khalifa about the gospel industry. So I said, oh, Grace Osa is coming. I think I can ask her some questions. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to that. Uh, before we get to the talking, uh, let me just sample some few comments. You're going to help me okay. on Facebook. Okay. Our question on Facebook today is simple. Uh, where would you like to travel to now that the lockdown has been lifted where would you like to travel to now that the lockdown has been lifted the, uh, your your response can be wishful thinking or it can be an actual plan so just tell us so we can share it with the rest of the world the first person is Fred Mosh uh, social Friday ni Fred, uh, Fred tuned in from Nax ningependa kutembea shimula tewa alafu DJ ni cheze mpenzi mtazamaji ya uchunglo familia alright that one I think we sample that one before uh, Sapere Boy, I, I remember Sapere Boy before. Uh, Bernard Kadambi has just commented uh, her. Jones Minor would like to revisit Mombasa. I think these are some comments to quote Shapitia as they look for the brand new ones. Keep them coming on our Facebook at Y254. Uh, for now, it's back to you. Uh, Miss, Mrs. Grace Hosea. Your camera is number four. Uh, was on a corner for the first time. Introduce yourself. <laughs> You've been given a chance. Thank you so much, Barry. Mm -hmm. It's such a pleasure to uh -huh. be here at it's Wine. It's a pleasure as well. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, it's, it's an honor. My name is Grace Osea. Mm -hmm. I'm born again. I love the Lord. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited to be here this morning. Mm -hmm. I'm married. A mother of two boys. I'm mm -hmm. married to a pastor. Mm -hmm. A mother of two boys, perfect and Yano mm -hmm. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's really a, a pleasure. When who again? <laughs> perfect and Yano. Perfect and Yan. Yes. I know what perfect means. What does Yan mean? Because I feel like there's a depth to these <laughs> names. Huh? Yan is John Mark. Yan? John Mark. All right. Yes. John Mark. Yes. All right. I like that one. Uh -huh. So uh, how is it being a mom? Uh, doing your masters at the University of Worlds, Kukua Mama Kanisa I know it's a lot of work. Uh, but it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Because uh -huh. uh, these things are all involving, mm -hmm. and you have to come to a place of balance. Mm -hmm. Which I, I uh, to me, if it was without God, mm -hmm. I couldn't have managed. Uh -huh. So, so I thank God for the wisdom that He's giving me uh -huh. to handle one thing at a time. One thing at yes. a time. All right. I'm um, told you grew up in uh, in South Nyanza, somewhere in South Nyanza. <laughs> yeah, sure, sure. All right. How was it uh, growing up in a setup like that? A, uh, a girl back in the day with big dreams like the ones you're achieving right now. Uh, I, I must say first thing, thanks to God mm -hmm. who allowed me to come and see the dreams come to pass. Because mm -hmm. when I was growing, uh -huh. I didn't know actually they'll come to pass. Uh -huh. But yeah. you had them. Yes, but uh -huh. I had them. You manifested them. I manifested them because <laughs> I remember I started singing when I was still in Sunday school. Mm -hmm. But I didn't know one day I'll sing, you know, and even uh -huh. do a song uh -huh. as a pastor's kid. And uh -huh. both of my parents are pastors. So. Oh, so it runs in the family. All right. <laughs> yeah, so I started uh -huh. singing even without even knowing who God is, you know. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. But I thank God because when you are in line with God's purpose, uh -huh. then it, uh, the, 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 the things that God uh, had planned... Uh -huh. To see in your life uh -huh. will come to be accomplished. All right. Because when, even you, when you're young, like uh -huh. in a David, but when God had called them, uh -huh. the time had just not come. Uh -huh. So it takes you through that uh, stages of preparations, uh -huh. you know, just to make you ready. Just yeah. to make you ready yeah. right there. All right. I had something that really got my attention. Yeah. Uh, this person was saying, uh, I won't mention the name, uh, but this person was saying, if you want to make God laugh, Tell him your plans. Because he has a bigger plan for you somewhere there, uh, but that you can't, even, you can't even conceptualize in your head. Have, did you have some plans that you knew one day I'm going to be this, but God just showed you another way in the, in the long run? 
Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, I personally didn't know mm -hmm. I, I, I would have ended up serving the Lord, mm -hmm. for example. When I was coming up, I knew uh, probably I'd just been the health profession, uh -huh. you know, mm -hmm. and do other things. Mm -hmm. But you see the plans of God, just as you say, mm -hmm. they're so much big uh -huh. beyond our comprehension. Uh -huh. So today I might see, you might see yourself very small. Uh -huh. You know, you don't see anything good. Uh -huh. But the plans that God has for you... Uh -huh. We just better go to God. He will tell you uh -huh. they are bigger. They are big, big things. All right. Yes. So you go to God every single day, I guess. Yes. Uh, sure. You pray. Yes. Uh, I, I don't know if it's in the morning or in the <laughs> evening, but every day you go to God. Yes. What I is the power of going to God every day for uh, for, for, for this guidance, uh, this reminder? You know, Barry, mm -hmm. if you make a pen, uh -huh. you know how that pen should work. You know the amount of ink it will contain. Yes, I and know. So all of us, when God created us, uh -huh. it is God who knows exact purpose. Mm -hmm. What grace you'd be doing today, uh -huh. what I'll be doing tomorrow, mm -hmm. you know how my life is going to be. Mm -hmm. So for me to live in a perfect life, uh -huh. I have to go to the author who made me, uh -huh. who knew grace I made, uh -huh. grace operates in these ways. Uh -huh. So many times we just miss it because we've left god uh -huh. aside and we want to do things so at times life is so tough uh -huh. yet he's just waiting to for us to turn to him and he will help you give give you a walking hand so it's through. very important to always it's remember very important to All go right. before god because he's i the always one who's like directing. remember but sometimes <laughs> i forget uh is it something that you struggle with as well yes mm -hmm. I have struggled, uh -huh. especially prayers. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was not easy. I didn't like it uh -huh. when I was just starting. Uh -huh. I didn't like praying because uh -huh. I, I used to see people pray sometimes for long and I wonder, hey, Connie, what are they saying all this time? And yet me, I, can, I can just speak something in a minute and I'm right. done. You see? <laughs> yeah. But I realized there's a difference. Uh -huh. When you go to pray uh, just as a normal church goer, mm. it becomes hard. But once you receive Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior, and the Lord gives you the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit will give you the strength and the desire to always want to pray. That is the difference. Thank you very much. For yes. That. I'd like to go back to your pen analogy. Seems Khalifa anatumia ink kidogo sana. Khalifa anatumia ink kidogo. Ink yake ni kidogo sana. Hey, remember Y254 on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter, and Y254 underscore channel on Instagram. TikTok is Y254 channel. We have Grace Osa, a minister of the word, an artist, and a health practitioner. So many things are happening in the world right now. And... Um, uh, the thing we were talking about uh, with VDJ Khalifa, uh, there was a time I used to see secular artists uh, transitioning to gospel. A lot of them. Yeah. Now it's the opposite. <laughs> so many gospel artists are transitioning to secular. Is it hard in the industry? Is it, is it hard to make some, so, some cash on, in the gospel industry? What is happening? Uh, Why are people transitioning to the other side? Yeah, people transition because of uh, different challenges. Mm -hmm. the, the Bible tells us that we don't judge. Mm -hmm. It is God. For number one. Yes. <laughs> that is the most important. Don't judge. Don't Judgment judge. is for God. Yeah, be, before you start saying, grace has done this, grace has done mm -hmm. this, it's always good to get to the root cause. Mm -hmm. What made grace probably act this way? Mm -hmm. And probably see, how do I pray for this uh, uh, person? Mm -hmm. Because it is not the will of God mm -hmm. for us to live serving him. Mm -hmm. That is not the will of God at all. Mm -hmm. But situations mm -hmm. can be tough. I, I, I can't say uh, it is smooth. It is tough, Barry. Mm -hmm. It is, it I know. is tough. The, the walk is tough. But uh, mm -hmm. one thing that keeps encouraging me always mm -hmm. is that our God takes you through stages mm -hmm. to prepare you. Barry, if you just came one day and just wake up and just find that you're a billionaire, you mm -hmm. know, you might you not even know, know how to, to handle yourself. yourself. You'll yes. be looking at people like trash. Uh -huh. But Just when you've that. gone through the hard steps, you uh -huh. know, you now know how it was hard to get that money. Mm -hmm. there's, there's, there's some level of respect, of, of respect and humility that you will, mm -hmm. you will have. So the process is the very process important. The process is it's tough, but uh -huh. it is very important. All right. So people are just going through their walks of life. As yes. we see them on YouTube, as we try to judge them, yeah. they're just in their walks of life. And uh, their journey is unique in its own way. It's unique in its own way. Uh -huh. So our, our duty is basically to pray for them. Uh -huh. Because if, if I see uh, uh, someone who is ministering the, uh, about, about the Lord, mm -hmm. my role mm -hmm. is to actually pray for them to stand. Mm -hmm. So when Because it's a tough journey. It's a tough journey. Uh -huh. Probably if you were there, we could have done something worse than what they did. Uh -huh. So it's a very tough journey. Uh -huh. And what can also maintain us 
uh, to, to help us remain where we are uh -huh. is always being in the presence of God. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes also we get to be too busy mm -hmm. until we leave that God. When you leave mm -hmm. that God, it's not easy to go through a temptation. When it will come, you, it's like the you high fall. chances you will fall. Mm -hmm. Because it is God who maintains you. It's not your own strength or what you do. Wow, powerful words on a Friday morning right there. Uh, Grace Jose is in the building on Y254 on, uh, on Y in the morning. Be sure to interact with us on our Facebook, as I told you, on Y254, uh, Twitter and Y254 channel, Instagram and Y254 underscore channel. All right, so your new song, part of it shot in South Africa, yeah. part shot in Nigeria. Big things are happening. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> why, why did you why do you invest so much in this like this so uh bar is not something that happened in a day All i right. started singing some uh, my first uh, recording i did in 2009 uh -huh. And do you know, I walked to the studio. Uh -huh. I didn't have even lunch uh -huh. during the time I was going to do that. Uh, uh -huh. I mean, my first uh, audio. Uh -huh. So it was very tough. Uh -huh. I, I just called a few friends. This was around the same time you graduated. Yes. All right. Yes. So uh, did you have a job then? No, I didn't have a job. All right. Uh, so when you graduate, you can say, Let me stop the Lord with my music as I see what next for me. Yeah. All right, so you go to the studio, you recorded your first song in 2009. Yes. What was the name of the song? Uh, my Shayangu, the album was called My Shayangu. A whole album? You recorded yes, a whole album? Yes, a very uh, powerful album. All right. Yeah. Your debut. Is it on streaming sites? Is it on YouTube? Yeah, and... the, 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 the YouTube. All right. Just yeah. tell them your YouTube channel so they can stalk you as we... Yeah. My YouTube channel is Grace Osea. Just mm -hmm. go to Grace Osea. You'll get uh, my songs there. Mm -hmm. You can also get me on Facebook, mm -hmm. uh, Grace Osea. Mm -hmm. Instagram, Grace Osea. Mm -hmm. uh, Twitter. Mm -hmm. Is it Twitter? It's Twitter. <laughs> Twitter. Yes, at, exactly. At GeoSea5. <laughs> GeoSea5. <Yeah, five>. So <laughs> All right. Yeah. I'm just looking at some of the clips in the video. Uh, this is a video. Yes. Right there. This is Wabaraka, yeah. Uh -huh. it's, it's, All right, so th these parts are shot in? Uh, so this part was in Nigeria. Uh -huh. Yes. Who's the director? Ose. It's called Ose. Ose area. All right. Yeah. Very good work right there, Mr. Ose. Yeah. Uh, and then some parts in South Africa. Yes. Which director from South Africa? He's the same guy. He's the same Ose. guy. Yeah. All right. Ose. Uh, they have both a team in, uh, in South Africa. They work as a team. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's just the same, same team. All right. Yeah. Uh, they have not set up in Kenya yet? No, 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 no. Not yet? Not yet. All right. Convince them to come around so <laughs> they make your work easier. Because <laughs> uh, this is very good work right there. I like the color coordination. I like the, the direction of the, of the outfits. I love good. everything about the video. I love yeah. the song as well. Be sure to check it out. Grace Jose on YouTube. Uh, who came up with the concept? Who came up with the scripting? Uh, we did it to the producer, of course. You did it with the producer. Yes. So, so they, this they, is they, partly they... you right there. These visuals that we are seeing. Right yes. Now. All right. I had done the song uh, before, mm -hmm. so uh, when I went to South Africa, I redid it. Okay. Yes. You redid the you, the audio and the video? Or just sure. The video? Uh, but then I don't done the video, oh, so the, oh, the oh, audio. Oh, so you started with the audio? Yes. And then you went to the video? Yeah. All right. Uh, what's special about this song? This song is very special mm -hmm. because when God gave me that, uh, the, the, when I was uh, doing the, the lyrics for this song, mm -hmm. Uh, God had spoken uh, that, that, that time about how great he is, mm -hmm. how mighty he is, mm -hmm. how he's a God full of blessings, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. how he cares for us. So when you listen to this song, mm -hmm. you get to understand who God is. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes you go through things and think life is so tough, mm -hmm. but we don't know the other side of God that he's also a blesser. Mm -hmm. In as much as we might have gone through challenges, mm -hmm. he's also a blesser. He will bless mm -hmm. you one day. Blesser you know. means a totally different thing, you know, in South Africa, I'm told. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. Yes, I know, I know, I know. It's just a, <laughs> is a healer, deviation for Is a healer in your situation? Mm -hmm. Is a healer in Ponyaji? Mm -hmm. You know, in, 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 if you are in need, mm -hmm. his name is Jehovah Jireh. He mm -hmm. will provide mm -hmm. at that particular time. So this song is so rich because uh -huh. it talks about the attributes of God, who it our talks God is. about the attributes yes. of God. Yeah. Is that somewhere in Cape Town? So yes, that All is right, Cape Town. So, so that, yeah, that yeah, place. yeah. This is Cape Town. All right, I yeah. only see it on Instagram. <laughs> I've never been there. <laughs> I just see it on Instagram. Yeah. I know those colors right there. Yeah. But thank you very much for this uh, blessing song right there. Uh, what should we look out for from Grace or Sarah? 
and family because <laughs> now I know it's a family business. Yeah, we, uh, we run a ministry mm -hmm. um, in town. Mm -hmm. Our church is just next to railway offices, mm -hmm. uh, just next to local health center, uh -huh. just at the it, uh, at the end of that bridge, our church is there. It's called Fruitful Center. Parakarimu na tuk. Eh. Apu yu barabara tu. Una panda yu bridge, then chini, our church is there. So the other side, ya landi mawe, ama this other side? Landi mawe, exactly. Eh. Eh. So kivuka tu bridge? Apu kwa bridge, tu mwisho tu apu. Church kwa apu. Okay, nice eh, one. Eh. All right, so you run your ministry there. Yes. Uh, I hear this Sunday, 100 people maximum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have to obey you. You have to obey. <laughs> yes. So what are you going to do? You're going to tell Washiri Kawengine, Mutakuja next Sunday, or how are you guys going to do it? No, I, I, we will look for wisdom that comes from above. Uh -huh. uh, of course, you can think of also having uh, services in shifts, uh -huh. probably s starting seven, you know, to eight, then, uh -huh. yeah, all those uh -huh. are options. As long but as the, the message gets home. The message gets home, and the most important thing that we uh, maintain the social distancing, mm -hmm. you know, and just make sure we sanitize and, mm -hmm. and, and do the right thing. Follow the regulations. Yeah. Uh, that was a slight deviation. Take me back to what should we should expect from Grace Ozea and Fire. Okay. Mm -hmm. What I want to say, uh, Barry, is that God is still at work. Mm -hmm. And uh, there are things probably God has not told me, mm -hmm. but there are things, there are projects that are already on the way we are working on. Mm -hmm. So when, uh, as soon as they are ready, mm -hmm. we'll bring them out. Mm -hmm. But there, there's a lot that already God has put in store for us. Mm -hmm. So keep waiting. Mm -hmm. Yes. We'll keep waiting for sure. <laughs> Remind them about your social media handles and how they can get to watch this amazing video yeah. uh, as we proceed. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So please go uh, uh, follow me on, uh, on, uh, on YouTube. Mm -hmm. uh, like, share. Share, subscribe, request for my songs, mm -hmm. <laughs> even at Y254. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll get me at, 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 at as Grace Osea mm -hmm. at YouTube. Instagram, also Grace Osea, you can follow me. Then uh, at Twitter, you can also follow me at, at G Osea 5. G Hosea 5. Yes, G Hosea 5. All right. At yes, this last Facebook. segment of the show, before you introduce your song, I like to put people on the spot a little bit. Are you going to forgive me? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know you're a forgiving person, but forgive me. I'll put you on the spot a little bit. Okay. Uh, as a health practitioner, you you're taking your masters in public health. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we've seen uh, what this quarantine thing has done. We have high school kids uh, are pregnant right now in numbers, in big numbers. This yeah. is a crisis. Yeah. Other people are saying this is the real pandemic. The other one was just <laughs> 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 pandemic. <laughs> in your pandemic, Kabisa. What do you have to say? about it uh, as a health practitioner and as a lady mm -hmm. uh, to me it is a sad thing mm -hmm. it is really a sad thing for me to see I mean young girls you know go through mm -hmm. that process children have children uh, yeah, there are mm -hmm. children who are my also parents at mm -hmm. the same time, but they are mm -hmm. actually young. Mm -hmm. it is a, it's, it's quite a sad thing. Mm -hmm. And as you're saying, it's a pandemic in itself. Uh -huh. So um, I just like to encourage us. Uh -huh. If we have uh, any girl around us, you know, uh, Kitambo, uh -huh. a child used to belong to the community. Yes, for sure. You know, it's uh -huh. not like nowadays when your child does something wrong and you know you can't, uh, you uh -huh. know. But I would have loved to see us as Kenyans arise uh -huh. to this thing as, 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 as a team, uh -huh. you know. Let the church take its part, uh -huh. you know. Let the parents take their role, uh -huh. our teachers, and even the health professionals, uh -huh. so that we're able to come together and just nurture these young ones. Uh -huh. the, the, uh, our young girls who are already pregnant, uh -huh. it is not the time to point stones at them. Uh -huh. Bring them close. Uh -huh. It's the time just to tell them now, it's this, already, is this is happening. Uh -huh. So what is the way forward? Uh -huh. And we don't just assume the, the men also who took yes. part in this. Uh -huh. They also need to get those sessions. We need to understand what made you do this, uh -huh. you know. How did they get to How did point? you get uh, to this point? Because uh -huh. it's really embarrassing. And, and to make it worse, most of them are not just strangers. Uh -huh. Some are even fathers and even, even brothers uh -huh. and sisters from one family. Uh -huh. So it's, it's, it's really disheartening. Uh -huh. But the biggest thing that can work this out uh -huh. is when the society turns and looks at Jesus Christ uh -huh. as the only source, you know, uh -huh. for change in a society. When you have God, you have love. Uh -huh. I mean, you can't come and rape me uh -huh. <laughs> if you have God and you have you genuine love. You know, uh -huh. you yes. will take care of me. Uh -huh. So the source is if our society can turn back to Christ, uh -huh. that can also be a very big source of solutions. To this generation christ is the answer christ is the answer as you say thank you very much for your time thank you very much for taking your time to hang yeah. up with us uh introduce your song and please tell them to keep requesting it so we can have it on rotation 
Yeah, so uh, my new song uh, from the kitchen is called Nguvu Yangu mm -hmm. by Grace Osea. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a powerful song, and I thank God it's, it's coming at a time when this, the, 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 the society, I mean, the world around is just full of discouragement. But we can get that strength from the Lord. You can get that salvation from the Lord. So I want to encourage you to request the song. Mm -hmm. Get to listen to it as the Lord ministers to you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you very much. You had <laughs> it straight from the horse's mouth. And right about now, we are about to play the song. So if you happen to love it, keep requesting it. VDJ Khalifa has it on lock. Our guest DJ of the day, uh, to our DJ Sal Me. Ni mwana mafanzo wake wamechocha sana pale Facebook is going to be with us on the next segment. So be sure to tune in and keep it locked. Let's listen to Nguvu Yangu by Grace Ozad and we'll be back. Wewe Nguvu Yangu, wewe amani yangu.